Hey everybody, happy Sunday. I'm coming on to do this week's um, that eyeshadow look. It was a tie, so I did this yesterday. These are the colors for that. Again, I don't know if I'd put these together, but they're so pretty. I, I just love all of our colors. Um, so this is one matte, three shimmers. This is Stay Golden. It's a shimmer, but it's very mild. Um, Stay Golden, also 100% of the proceeds of Stay Golden go towards foster awareness. And um, this is Stardust Ginger. Don't be afraid of ginger. It's gorgeous. Oh my goodness. It looks scary, but it's so beautiful. And Philly. I added cupcake in here just to brighten up my brow. And this is my cleaning tile. I've already done my basic hack. I have um, La Cienega on my lip and cheek. Really pretty shimmery, kind of a shimmery coral color. I'm going to be using, as always, my eyeshadow brush. All our brushes are two-ended. Eyeshadow brush is the easiest way to put your eyeshadow on. You cannot mess up. So I'm going to go in that fluffy in. I'm going to use Stay Golden kind of as my base color. I'm just going to do a wash all over my eyelid and kind of up a little bit towards that brow bone. This is a super pretty, even though it's called golden, it's just got a hint of gold in it. It's really pretty tan gold, very minimal shimmer. Look at that. Go on again, fill up the other side. I like to do one eye, one eye, one eye, one eye, just so that they can be as close as possible. And you know, our eyes are not 100% identical. So they won't always look perfectly the same and that's okay. Kind of like our brows. We like to say they're sisters, not twins. All right, so stay golden. And again, you could just use this as a one and done out the door. So, so pretty. Okay, next I'm gonna go into Philly. Philly's a matte, it's a very pretty, um, really chocolatey brown color. And I'm gonna use the other end of my eyeshadow brush. And I'm gonna come out here and just make a little greater than sign. Just a little one right out here, up to my brow bone and down. Now, if you have hooded lids, you can do this more across and down, make it more like a seven. I don't have hooded lids, so get other side over and down. So greater than, less than. And I know this looks a little crazy now. It will not once I blend. Then I'm gonna go into my, I'm gonna use my multitasker. Also for Philly, and just kind of dip that flat end and just under that eye, just very lightly line. All of our eyeshadows can be used as a liner. If you want it really bold, you can spray it with a setting spray and make it more of a liquid liner. But honestly, they last all day, the liner, as the eyeshadow as a liner. It's it's just amazing. All right. So now I'm gonna go into back into that eyeshadow brush. Come out here and just fluff it in. Kind of just bringing it into my crease and fluffing around in circles. Just get that little bit blended. So bring it into my crease and fluffing, mainly keeping the color out here, but just dragging it in a little bit. Same thing out here. Bringing it in and fluffing it out. So again, this is Stay Golden plus Philly. Next, I'm gonna go into Ginger, I believe. Oh, I love Ginger. Ginger really scared me when I first got it, just cause it's a bold color, but oh my goodness, it's so pretty. But look at these two together, like honestly, two colors out the door you could do. It's so pretty. All right, for ginger, I'm going to use our smudge brush so I can go really right kind of out on that outer edge where I want to place it. And the smudge brush has kind of a fluffier end and a little bit of a flatter end. I'm going to grab that flatter end and just kind of tap into that ginger just to get a little bit. And I'm going to come out here. Look at that color. Ah, oh, gorgeous. Again, just kind of on the outer kind of inside that greater than less than sign is where I'm putting that ginger. Same thing over here. I'm just kind of patting it into place. I don't want to get too much fall out of my face. I always get a little bit, but that's okay. Cause I just spoop it away. Okay, ginger. Next, I'm gonna use my finger for Stardust. Stardust is this really neat color. Um, it's kind of, it's really shimmery, but it's kind of a green, kind of an olive, kind of a silver. It's stardust. 
and I'm going to put that right in that inner place. I like using my finger because I can just kind of get it right where I want it and just give it that bright little pop. Okay, and then I'm going to blend them, but look how pretty that stardust is. These are the neatest colors. Like I said, I would never like say, Kim, pick me out a palette. I wouldn't pick these four, but I saw them and I thought, oh, these are going to be pretty. Okay, let's go back into my eyeshadow brush. I'm going to clean it off. So with the tile, what you do in between colors is you just kind of wipe it away. It doesn't clean the brush 100%, but it'll let you switch between colors. All right. And I'm going to just kind of meld that stardust into that ginger, into that filly out here. Clean it off. And again, stardust into ginger into filly. And then if you want, you can kind of smudge this out a little bit. Okay, then clean off my brush. I'm just gonna add cupcake up top to really brighten up here. So I'm cleaning that off. Cupcake is one of our mattes. And I just like to come right in here where the arch of your brow is and fan it out. And it's just a very subtle, but you'll see, it just kind of brightens it up up there. I love cupcake. I use it pretty much every day. Okay, and then what I'm gonna do lastly, you put your like mascara on now. I'm gonna grab just my main brush and just in case I have any fallout, I'm just gonna come down because don't forget our um, facial, facial kind of foundations and hacks are creams. So they really easily, if you have any fallout, you can just kind of brush it away. And this gives it a very finished look just by drawing it up and out. So. Those are those colors. I'll send a picture later. If you wanted to make this kind of bolder, you could just deepen that filly on the outside. Um, thank you for watching. If you have questions, always shoot them my way. Everyone enjoy your Sunday.